Thank you for your interest in ReliableTenant.ca. The goal of Reliable Tenant is to ensure, one, the property is in safe hands, and two, the tenant is capable enough to pay us on time. Our experience is most of the problems are eliminated if this is done properly. Initial screening. Our philosophy is that $25 less per month is any time better than a shady tenant. In order to determine the reliability of tenants, we look at the following things. Job letter, pay stubs, check with employer, length of employment, credit check and liabilities, how many people will stay, smokers if any, pets if any, why are they relocating, Canadian citizens or visitors, guarantors if any. Our experience is more questions you ask, the harder it becomes for tenants to bluff. This gives us a fairly good idea if the tenant is reliable. Once we are satisfied, we shall recommend this tenant to you. Also, we will be extracting all important details on a single page so it becomes easy for you to have a bird's eye view. Once you give a green signal, then we start preparing paperwork. It is important here to understand paperwork should be within the guidelines of the Ontario Landlord and Tenancy Board. To ensure this, we have a ready access to our lawyer should the need be. Upon completion of this paperwork, your property is leased. Smooth handing over possession. I have seen confusion arrive simply because landlord and tenants are not told in advance what is expected of them. To avoid this, we give a list of things to do to both landlords and tenants. One of the things we do insist on is tenant and landlord preparing inspection checklist, preferably with photos, as this eliminates tenants claiming later on, but this is how it was. Now that the property's possession is handed over to the tenant, the job is done. From here on, in an ideal world, things should go on smooth and landlords' phones should never ring. But that's not what happens. Often, some issues arise and landlords need to intervene. Now imagine this happening when you are on vacation. To address this, ReliableTenant.ca offers two types of support packages. Number one, any support for $120 a year. And two, A to Z support for $200 a year. Any support means any kind of issue, any time of year, and any number of times. Things may break down like appliances not working, plumbing issues, electrical issues, window issues, a key goes missing, alarm system issues, furnace or AC not working, garage door not working, garage remote missing, etc. Should this occur, we promptly depute an authorized tradesman to fix the issue. You can later pay the tradesman against the bill. Remember, happy tenants will always take care of your property well. A to Z support is a combination of any support plus imposing authority. One of the hardest things to determine is the nature of the tenant. Although majority of the tenants are law-abiding, others are demanding and at times like to push their luck. Imagine not following condo rules, unclean property, unauthorized people residing, dangerous pets, harassing neighbors, smoking in premises, not maintaining grass, not shoveling the walkway, or as serious as not paying the rent and not vacating. Should this occur, we will promptly refer this case to our lawyer, who will in turn issue a proper notice to tenant. Our experience is that tenants tend to mend their ways once they realize this can result in eviction. Please note we bear all the lawyer charges and LTB fees. So far I talked about what is included. I also want to talk about what is not included to avoid misunderstanding. We do not visit property once a tenant moves in. We are not present while landlord actually hands over possession to tenant. We encourage landlords to keep in touch with tenants. Research shows that a simple phone call from landlords inquiring, how are things going, is highly appreciated by tenants. We cannot be held responsible for personal behavioral issues. Example, someone isn't very clean, or someone's guests are often noisy. Someone may not follow condo or city bylaws. Someone may not shovel snow, etc. These things are hard to establish before selecting a tenant. However, we can certainly issue notices to tenants through proper channels. We do not deal with litigations. Suppose at the time of vacating property, if a tenant leaves the property unclean, damages walls, light bulbs aren't working, appliances not working properly, or the tenant leaves his personal belongings behind, etc. Landlord and tenancy board doesn't get involved in this, hence we do not have any leverage to make tenant fall in line. Such things fall under litigations and damages and can be claimed from small claims court. We are not enforcers. Landlord and Tenancy Board has resources to enforce laws. We work within the guidelines of the Landlord and Tenancy Board. Please note that our services should not be misunderstood as landlord's involvement is zero. 
In fact, contrary to that, we very much expect landlords to do their part in ensuring things move smoothly. Lastly, how to attract good tenants. Remember, good tenants attract towards good property and bad tenants attract towards inferior property. So it is crucial that you get your property reasonably ready. Here is a checklist. Does a property need a fresh coat of paint? Do all light bulbs work? Do all appliances work? Does property need professional cleaning? Is professional carpet cleaning needed? Take care of any small repairs, if any. We have identified this as a major source of headache, misunderstanding, and blame game. So please do not cut corners here. Also, it is better to get these things done beforehand and not leave it to just before handing over possession. As some tenants often claim, it is not done properly or it is not up to the mark. With this, our presentation ends. Do let me know if you have any questions.